today i am going to discuss an important topic that is vaccination in children it is always said that prevention is better than cure and vaccines are one of the most important methods to prevent common infectious diseases like polio measles chickenpox besides others quite recently we faced a pandemic of corona and with the help of vaccinations now we are able to control this and we are slowly going back to the normal all this is possible only with the help of vaccination similarly there are multiple diseases for which there are vaccines available and these vaccines are not only effective but also safe in children the vaccination starts at birth usually children before discharge they receive three vaccine do- that is vaccine for tuberculosis which is known as bcg then they receive vaccine for polio which is an oral vaccine and hepatitis b these three vaccines are given at birth before discharge and then subsequently the vaccination is continued at 6 weeks 10 weeks 14 weeks and beyond it is important for the parents to understand to give these vaccines timely if we do not give vaccines timely then the benefit which we get from these vaccines is not going to be good the immunity is not going to be good and if we do not complete a schedule which is there for a particular vaccine for example for dpt we have three doses at 6 10 14 if we do not give these three doses and followed by a booster at later age then the benefit which we need to sort from that vaccine is not going to happen so always start your vaccination for your children in time and complete it as per schedule it's also important to know that common cold mild degree of fever is not a contraindication to get your child vaccinated vaccines are safe and there are only few side effects and majority of them are very mild for example some vaccines can lead to fever which is usually low grade and does not last for more than 1 to 2 days it simply needs paracetamol and that is all sometimes it can also lead to local redness in induration which is again a short problem and it usually subsides of its own there are also various myths regarding vaccines that they increase the risk of autism allergy but recent studies and there is now enough literature to tell us that vaccines are not associated with any such disorder in fact vaccines decrease the risk of infectious diseases and also help us in herd immunity that is as more as more children get their vaccines it serves a community benefit and also for that individual and also for that community so if majority of the children are vaccinated the community as such is protected from these infectious diseases which are almost totally preventable with the help of vaccines but if we do not give the vaccines in time then the same disease can happen at a later age and can turn out to be deadly so it's my request to all the parents to kindly get all their children vaccinated before discharge from the hospital and subsequently as per your vaccination schedule they are totally safe and effective